Hello and welcome to my video tutorial. Today we're going to be showing you how to use iTunes. Uh, this is, I would say, the most best program to uh, organise music, video and uh, TV shows and stuff like that all in one place. Uh, everything keeps 100% organised. Uh, it's very easy to use and now today I'm going to be showing you how to create smart, pl smart playlists, uh, how to keep your music organized, your playlist organized in albums, in uh, folders and stuff. Uh, so let's start off by, we'll find a track, uh, say, meet me half where? Uh, Black Eyed Peas. We've got two there. We've got Floor Fillers version and the actual Black Eyed Peas album version. So what we want to do is we want to create a smart playlist for these um, for this video, this uh, song. So what we do is we go on name is meet me half way. That's okay. And there you go. What it's done then it's found all the search for all my library and found everything that matches that command. And it's come up with these two, which I only want one of them, I only want the one with the end. So if you right click or command click, uh, edit smart playlist, and then you click the plus icon here, and then what you do is then you pick album is the end. If you press OK, and it's removed that. Right, easy enough. Say like if you want to get everything from Black Eyed Peas on your computer. Right, so what we're going on, we uh, go from artist is Black Eyed Black Eyed Peas. Press OK. Right, it's coming with all these now. Say like if you only want ones like that proper not remixes like from Clubland and Floor Fillers. So what we do then is we edit Smart Playlist. We add another command. We add one like uh, say album does not contain Clubland. Press OK. Clubland's gone. And we do the same again. Plus album does not contain floor fillers. And also, say if you want to get rid of um, that one love, plus album does not contain one. Love. And there we go, that's uh, command was wrong. Um, see, so we've got uh, duplicates, like I've got a feeling. I mean, a good way of organising this is by pressing name. When it does then, it puts everything together. Right, I don't want that. So, what we do then is edit smart playlist, or we'll try something different, try a different approach. Uh, name does not contain just say uh, C H I C A G O. There we go. Ah, there we go. Right, and here we go. I got a feeling three times. So if we do the same because they're all got the same. We we'll have to try and get rid of it by using an album rule so plus album does not contain say the club and then plus album does not contain the yeah. Uh, we got any more there? Um, no. 
So there we go. We've got every song on my computer in the library that says by Black Eyed Peas. So that's one way of creating small smart playlists. So we'll just delete that. Delete. Right. Um, I organise all my albums in that in a folder called album. Um, so drum and bass, dubstep, Floyd and Waters, gay tunes. Uh, yeah, uh, you know, you know all the type type of stuff. Uh, miscellaneous, no, sort of trance and hardcore. So we got albums here. Right, Club Blood Ministry Sound NRG Bass Generation. Blah 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 blah. Right. So that's all you all you need to do. File new playlist folder and call it a bit. Yep, right. And just say like if I now I want to want to import uh, some music I've downloaded. So trance. So this is uh, top hundred trance anthems. So I'll do then. Make sure you on iTunes that you select, make a playlist that you just want to use just for importing. It's what I do, it's the easiest way. Right, so you got top selected there. You do. Command and all. Keep all the command. Take the ones you don't want, which is like them free use and blah blah blah. How you do then is drag and drop directly into that playlist that you've already uh, created connect okay, off that now just adding files now they have imported what we'll do is we'll uh, select one a chance to catch up right command and A select all and command and I. That will do now. Ask you if you want to edit multiple items. That's yes. Right. The artist ain't VA, but we'll just leave that for the moment. Right. It's top 100 each trans anthems. So if we just get rid of these. Let's put another zero on there. And get rid of them. Just a bit ugly. Top 100, it's Champ Anthems. Right, now that's how they'll all be. What we'll do then, select all by dragging or commanding it, and then command and C, and then you see that happen in the top left corner. It just show that you have actually copied it and press OK. Right. Still processing now because I've just changed the name, so it's going to change all these down until it gets right to the end. Right, it's done now. Right, I'll go back up here, wait for the pinwheel to finish doing what it's doing. Right, click a beat, then click file, new smarts playlist, and then album is command and V. Now we've got top 100 hits trans anthems. Press OK, and what it'll do then? It's found them all in that playlist, and then it puts them all here, ready in that a beat. And then go back down here, select your playlist, and command them all again, and then just press the backspace, and then get rid of them, so it keeps it clogged free. Imported uh, some music into a playlist and then put them into a smart playlist in an organized folder well that this is the first part of my tutorial uh, hope you click the jump button to view the next one thanks for listening